Hi everyone, this is Tony here. In this video, we're going to cover the process of how to interact with the Hermes network mainnet. We'll see how to access the wallet step by step, the different actions that you can do, and you'll find plenty of useful links in the description below. Before we start, bear in mind that this video is only for educational purposes and is not financial advice. First of all, to interact with the Hermes network, you'll need a MetaMask wallet connected to the Ethereum network and some Ether in it. So you can install the wallet by going to metamask.io and clicking download. Once you have it, fund it with some ETH. Okay, let's go to wallet.hermes.io and let's connect our MetaMask wallet. Click here in connect and you'll need to sign this message. Now we're in the wallet interface. If it's the first time that your wallet is connected, the only action available will be deposit. Uh, and by depositing, you'll be moving your funds from the Ethereum layer one to the Hermes network layer two. So let's click on deposit and let's deposit some HES. So let's deposit all my HES, click continue. Here are the details of the transaction and click on deposit. This is the first confirmation message. You need to allow wallet.hermes.io to spend your HES. So click on confirm. And here are the gas fees of this transaction. If you click on edit and you go to advance, you can set it out to the limit that you are comfortable with. So let's click on save, let's click confirm. And you see the transaction has been submitted. If we hit done, you see here that the transaction is pending. So let's give it a couple of minutes. Okay, while we wait for the deposit to be executed, let's have a look at this top menu that we have here. On the top right, we have my code, which is a QR code that you can use to scan other addresses once you're using a mobile phone. And on the top left, you have my account where you have several options to configure like a currency conversion, force withdrawal, view in Batch Explorer or disconnect your wallet. So let's go back and let's wait for our deposit. Here we go, the deposit has been executed. So let's see now how to send funds to another Hermes address. To do this, you just need to select the token that you want to send, like HES, and click send. Input the amount, in this case, let's send half of it. And let's just paste here the address that you want to send to. This is the fee that you'll be paying. And click on continue. Here are all the details of the transactions. Click send and it says the transaction is completed. If you click done, you'll see that it's pending. And if you click in the send, you can see here all the details and you can even come here and see it in Explorer. So this is the Explorer of the Hermes network is the equivalent of uh, Etherscan for Ethereum, where you have all the information of the transaction, like the transaction ID, the status, the timestamp, the to and the from. So you can even go here in the top left and you have access to the overview of the Batch Explorer where you have the network status, some statistics about the network and some batches information of all the transactions being processed. So let's go back to the wallet and let's give it a couple of minutes for the transaction to be executed. Okay, uh, in the meantime, let's explore the third option, which is withdraw. So if we click here on withdraw and let's say that we want to take back the rest of the HES back to our MetaMask. Remember that the withdraw is the opposite of deposit. So this transaction will also incur in gas fees depending on the congestion of the Ethereum network. So if we click continue, you have here more information about the withdrawal and it says that once started is not reversible. So if we click initiate withdrawal and click done, you see here that step one out of two, the withdrawal has been initiated and we'll need further confirmation in a couple of minutes. So let's wait for it. Here we go. We have step two out of two, the withdrawal is still on hold. So now we need to click on finalize. And here we have the details of the withdrawal. Just click withdrawal. And again, we'll have to click in confirm and pay the gas fee. Just click confirm and it says the withdrawal is awaiting verification and just hit done. So those are the three actions that you can do in the Hermes mainnet wallet. 
Um, before we go, one more thing we want to show, it's how to give feedback on the mainnet. If you go to our Discord channel, which you have a link to in the description below, you can go to the rules channel and click on this handshake emoji here and you'll, you'll become a full member and then you have access to all the channels. And here under technical, you have support. Here you can come and leave any issues that you have and our team will take care of it. Thank you very much for your time. I'll see you in the next video.